Well, hey there, and welcome to today's video presentation. I am Arthur Morris, and I've been photographing birds for 38 years. I can help you learn to make better bird pictures. Be sure to visit and subscribe to the blog. There's an active link below. If at all possible, after you see this video, you're going to want to get down to Fort DeSoto for the third IPT. I can teach you to see and use the light, get close to free and wild birds, use beautiful backgrounds, make pleasing blurs when the light is low, and make tight, sharp images of beautiful subjects like this little least turn chick from Nickerson Beach. Be sure to use the discount code when you shop at Bedford's for your photo gear. Save 3%, get free second day air shipping. And now let's take a look at the amazing morning on day two of the second Fort DeSoto IPT. The day pretty much began with a double rainbow, a miraculous sight. Put the sand mat in the foreground. IPT veteran Jim Miller had a 12 to 24 Sony lens in his backpack that he shared around so everybody could get a shot. Then we had a great blue heron in the marsh and we got to practice our compositional skills, getting the bird in the corner of the frame, zooming out for more of a habitat shot. So lots of practice on developing compositional and exposure skills as well. Then I added the teleconverter, the 1.4X teleconverter to the 200 to 600 lens with the A1 and got some nice stuff on a sandpiper flapping after the bath. And then a cloud came over, so worked at a higher ISO without the teleconverter. Got some nice stuff on short bill dowager. Then we headed out to the beach. I added the 1.4X. We got silly seven feet away from some royal turns. And when he preened, I blasted him. Amazingly, with the teleconverter added to this 200 to 600, I did some flight photography, again with the teleconverter and the 200 to 600, super sharp. I was quite impressed with that combination. Same here, light got a little softer, so we talked about exposure. Then we had a beautiful black storm cloud, and it was just a slaughter. So it started off as a slow day, became one of the great days. We wound up staying at the beach until after 1230, photographing. Everybody was thrilled. A sandwich turn. This with the 200 to 600 alone in the A1, looking like a fairy turn, sandwich turn landing. Gotta love that dark blue sky. Next frame, another one with a fish. And then the light started to soften up and we, we hit the road at about 1230. Royal turn landing. So if you wanna get some great photography opportunities, come down and learn from the best. Till then, make some great pictures. Love you, see you then.